Tom Hanks and Gary Sinise have a long history of taking on monumental roles and putting their entire heart and soul into them. One of their projects together, Forrest Gump, is now Gary Sinise's four-decade spanning career. Gary Sinise has spent the better part of his adult life working in the entertainment industry. In 1974, when he was just 18, he co-founded the Steppenwolf Theatre Company in Chicago. Two decades later, he was nominated for Golden Globes, Screen Actors Guild Awards, and Academy Awards for his portrayal of Lieutenant Dan Taylor in Forrest Gump. Other films he's appeared in include Apollo 13, The Green Mile, Mission to Mars, Snake Eyes, The Human Stain, and Imposter. His most recent projects include the films I Still Believe and Good Joe Bell, as well as the Netflix original series 13 Reasons Why. Fans of procedural crime dramas know he starred as Jack Garrett for two seasons on CBS's Criminal Minds Beyond Borders. And for nine seasons, he played Detective Mac Taylor on the hit CBS drama CSI NY. For his work in film and television, Sinise has won an Emmy, Golden Globe, and two SAG Awards for his roles in George Wallace and Truman. He's also received a SAG nomination for his stellar performance in The Stand. Before we tell you more, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Lieutenant Dan was a very personal role for Sinise. To make it appear as if Sinise had really lost his legs was no easy task. When filming scenes without legs, Sinise's legs had to be wrapped in a bright blue fabric that served a similar function as a green screen. The blue fabric made it easier for the FX team to digitally remove his legs after filming. Sinise also an illusionist was called in to design his wheelchair, so the feet was pulled off just as any magician's stage show disappearing trick would work. Even though the special chair worked for the purposes of the film, Sinise had a difficult time sitting in it, seeing as how it required him to hold his body in a very uncomfortable position. Because of this, he could only film in 10-minute intervals whenever the wheelchair was in use. Do you remember watching Saturday morning cartoons while you ate breakfast as a child? Magic Spoon cereal brings me back to those days, but without the unhealthy sugars of other cereals. There are only 140 calories per serving, 0 grams of sugar, 13 to 14 grams of protein, and only 4 to 5 net grams of carbs in each serving. I've included Magic Spoon into my morning routine, and I'm loving the flavor Blueberry Muffin. Click the link below to get some Magic Spoon cereal today. It's backed with a 100% happiness guarantee. You can build your very own variety box and use my code FACTSFIRST for $5 off. But wait, Magic Spoon is now adding Honey Nut to their permanent collection. Also, for my Canadian and British fans, Magic Spoon is now shipping to Canada and the UK. So click the link below and use the code FACTSFIRST for $5 off or go to magicspoon.com slash FACTSFIRST to save $5 off your order today. And be sure to add the new Honey Nut to your custom box. After 9-11, he formed the Gary Sinise Foundation. Gary's brother-in-law fought in Vietnam. Because of this, he had a personal connection to the war. While filming Forrest Gump, Sinise wore his brother-in-law's rosary in his honor. While portraying Lieutenant Dan, Gary's eyes were open to the troubling issues that many soldiers have to face after returning home from serving their country, especially those injured in service. After filming wrapped up on Forrest Gump, Sinise began supporting nonprofit organizations meant to help soldiers. In the years since Forrest Gump hit theaters, he's become known for his advocacy in the area. He felt particularly called to this issue after the events of September 11th. According to the website of the Gary Sinise Foundation, the actor was inspired to form the charity after meeting a first responder injured badly during the deadly terrorist attacks that happened that day. The FDNY firefighter that Sinise met was a quadruple amputee who needed a home that would be accessible to his special needs. Sinise ended up raising the money to help him move into an acceptable living space, but his work didn't stop there. These days, the Gary Sinise Foundation annually raises more than $30 million for wounded soldiers. It even owns 12 jet aircraft, which it uses to fly families of fallen or injured soldiers to different regions of the world. Sinise and Hanks have worked together on several groundbreaking projects. Although Forrest Gump was the only one to win Best Picture, Hanks and Sinise have also appeared alongside each other in films like Apollo 13 and The Green Mile both of which were also nominated for Oscars. Hanks was adamant about keeping Forrest Gump as historically accurate as possible. His insistence on authenticity, however, 
may have led to more exposure for real soldiers in need. If Hanks hadn't been so focused on the film being historically accurate, the Gary Sinise Foundation may never well have come into existence. Hanks helped contribute to getting the organization up and running in another significant way. His favorite scene in Forrest Gump was the one in which Lieutenant Dan received his new prosthetic legs. Sinise saw how moving that intimate moment could be and these days gives thousands of soldiers new legs through his organization. Gary's personal life and his Lieutenant Dan band. Sinise married retired actress Moira Harris in 1981. They've had three children together. A year after his wife retired from acting in 2003, with the help of veteran musician Kimo Williams, Sinise formed a cover band in Chicago called the Lieutenant Dan Band. The duo started the band to perform at USO shows, entertain troops, and raise funds for disabled vets. The concept for the band came about after Sinise asked if it would be permissible to bring musicians along on his USO tours. At first, the group was known as Gary Sinise and the Lieutenant Dan Band, but it was later shortened. Since 2004, the band has performed for charities and nonprofits, including the USO and Operation Iraqi Children, the latter of which was co founded by Sinise in 2004. In 2011, a documentary film was released that dealt with the band and Sinise's philanthropic efforts to provide aid to veterans. The band frequently plays at military bases in the U.S. and abroad. And in 2019, it was reported they'd played more than 400 concerts. In 2014, Gary, with the help of his band and the funds they raised, contributed to the construction of the American Veterans Disabled for Life Memorial in Washington, D.C. For his humanitarian work, Sinise has been awarded with the Bob Hope Award for Excellence in Entertainment, as well as the Spirit of the USO Award, the Doughboy Award, the Sylvanus Thayer Award, and the Dwight D. Eisenhower Award. In 2008, Sinise was bestowed with the prestigious Presidential Citizens Medal by then-President George W. Bush. Now it's time to hear from you. Did you know about Gary Sinise and his philanthropic efforts? Let us know in the comment section below. And before you go, make sure you give this video a like and subscribe to Facts First if you haven't already. Click the bell icon to stay updated on all our latest content. By the way, if you haven't joined Facts First as a member yet, be sure to look below this video and click the join button. By becoming a paid member of Facts First, you'll get access to exclusive video content that you won't find anywhere else. This includes some of our more mature content that isn't suitable for public audiences, which includes topics like Hollywood actresses who posed for Playboy and some of the steamiest moments in movie history. Plus, you can enjoy these videos completely ad-free. Our biggest fans will notice they also get badges next to their name when they leave comments on our videos. We pay special attention to comments from our members and so do other viewers. So if you want exclusive content from Facts First or inside access to discussions with other community members, click the join button to get started for just $4.99. There are hours of members only videos waiting for you with new videos added every month. And we're actively working on bringing even more features to help fans like you connect with other members and get more of your favorite content. Just click join and we'll see you inside the membership tab.